So much, Brad. Well, uh, hundreds of UC's ROTC program uh, folks took to the stairs of Nippert Stadium today for an annual commemorative climb. And as I found out this morning, it had nothing to do with special training, but rather this was all a way to remember civilians and first responders killed during the September 11th attacks 15 years ago. Men and women from all stages of fitness came out for the challenge and the 56 minute continuous run around Nippert Stadium. Uh, 2071, that's the amount of steps the first responders went up before the uh, World Trade Towers collapsed. Uh, so for here, that's about two and a half times around Nippert Stadium. Some 360 people participated in this second annual UC 9 11 Stadium stair climb, each one of them here for the very same reason. Because it was a tragic event, and we lost so many important people that day and so many family members. It's no easy climb, but that sacrifice is what motivates this group to keep running and remembering. Terrence Harrison served in Iraq and runs UC's veterans program. Yeah, it's very humbling, um, once again, for them to take time out of their busy schedule to come here and support us and, and just to show the region, like, hey, we'll never forget the events of September 11, 2001. And local students are marking the 15th anniversary of September 11th this morning. Seven Hill School held a tunnel walk. They walked quietly two miles around campus to remember the victims of the 9-11 terror attacks. One of those victims, Stephen Siller, a New York firefighter, ran three miles through a tunnel to save several lives before losing his own life. After the walk, students hung handmade doves along that tunnel.